I report now to Southampton, where the former Harley Davidson dealership building on College Highway is being considered for a different purpose, a temporary processing center. Western Mass News reporter Olivia Hickey joining us live in studio with more on that. Olivia. Chris, the temporary processing facility would be for legal immigrant families, pregnant women, and those displaced by natural disasters. Now, town officials say they learned about the state's idea this week. And locals we spoke with say they are all for it. I'm a veteran, and just things that have happened to me in my life, and I've had to stay at, like, veteran shelters and stuff like that. And if we didn't have things like that, then I don't know where I would be. So I think it's a great thing. East Hampton resident James Gallagher reacting to the idea of a temporary processing center for legal immigrants, pregnant women, and those impacted by natural disasters coming to Southampton. According to the town administrator's office, they were contacted by the state about possibly using the former Harley Davidson property on College Highway. Now details are limited, but what we know is a capacity of 100 families up to 400 people is being considered. They would be processed through the facility within a week and move to more permanent housing in the Bay State. Discussions have mainly focused on impact to fire, EMS, and the Board of Health. Local school services tell Western Mass News there would be no impact to the area schools if families were there for one week. But if they're in town longer, placement of students and additional English language services will be discussed. Services to the families, including food, cots, laundry, and staffing, would be provided by third parties. And the facility would be staffed 24-7. Town officials note the situation is moving quickly. If the facility is chosen, the town could see its first group of families next month. We spoke with locals Wednesday afternoon, who say they are open to this idea. The world is in such a horrible shape at this point, and... Um, the displaced people, the Ukrainians, the only thing that we can change is our own attitudes and a lot of the attitudes need to be changed. And Gallagher notes it's important for people to realize everyone needs help once in a while. At first, maybe it might seem like something strange or people might be opposed to it, but like there's a human element and we should help everybody. Before moving forward, the property owner has to agree to the temporary use of their property for this purpose. According to public records, the property was bought in 2021 by Shivza LLC, which is registered to the same address as Benuta Patel, who owns a liquor store across the street. Now we stopped by the business this afternoon, but no one was available for comment. Reporting live, Olivia Hickey for Western Mass News. Olivia, thank you.